Hello everyone, welcome back to year 2 science lesson. We are still in unit 8, mixture, with the topic soluble and insoluble materials. This time, we are going to do an investigation about stirring a mixture. Without wasting much time, let's get to it. Let's go! Let's go! Alright boys and girls, before we go straight to the investigation, let us do some revision on our previous lesson. Previously, we have learned that some materials can dissolve in water, such as sugar and food coloring powder. Meanwhile, some materials cannot dissolve in water, for example, corn kernels, pebbles and peanut. And we also learned that soluble materials are the materials that can dissolve in water. And Insoluble materials are the materials that cannot dissolve in water. I hope you still remember this. Now we are back to our investigation. The apparatus and materials that we need for this investigation are water, three label beakers, but in this case, since I don't have the beakers with here with me at home, I changed the beakers to three label glasses. Just ordinary drinking glasses. Next, glass rod. This one I also changed to chopsticks because I don't have glass rod here with me at home. Next, one teaspoon of salt, one teaspoon of green beans, and one teaspoon of rice. Now, let's start our investigation with step one. Pour 200 ml of water into each glass. Step 2. Add salt into glass A. green beans into glass B and rice into glass C Step 3 Stir the water in each glass and observe the changes Now, let's observe what happened to the salt in glass A. Is it visible or not visible? Is it dissolved in the water or the salt do not dissolve in the water? Next, let's observe what happened to the green beans in glass B. Is it visible or not visible? Do you think it's dissolved in the water? or the green bean do not dissolve in the water. Next one, let us observe what happened to the rice in glass C. Is it visible or not visible? Do you think rice dissolve in the water or rice do not dissolve in the water? Alright everyone, as usual, we need to record our investigation. To do this, please get ready with your science year 2 exercise book. Write down the date and the title of the investigation, which is stirring a mixture. Next, copy all of these steps, just like the one that you see in this slide. Step 1, pour 200ml of water into each glass. Step 2, add salt into glass A, green beans into glass B, and rice into glass C. Step 3. Stir the water in each glass and observe the changes. Step 4. Record your observation in the table as shown below. Now, let me explain to you how to fill in this observation table. As you can see here, we have three glasses. Glass A, 
glass B and glass C. Glass A contains the salt and the water, glass B with the green beans and the water, and gla glass C with the rice and the water. Based on your observation that we have done earlier, if you still can see the salt in the water, you should write down visible. If you cannot see the salt in the water anymore, you should write down not visible. Same goes to the green beans and the rice. If you still can see them, you just write down visible. If you cannot see the materials, you write down not visible. And then this column. If you think based on your observation, the salt is dissolved in the water, you write down dissolve. Based on your observation, if you don't think the salt dissolve in the water, you write down do not dissolve. Same goes to the green beans and the rice. Easy, isn't it? Next, please complete this question down here. Alright, blanks, dissolve in water. Blank and blank, do not dissolve in water. So, what materials dissolve in the water? And what materials? There are two more materials that do not dissolve in water. I think you should know the answer by now. Oh, before I forgot. Please copy all of this in your Science C2 exercise book and please write it down neatly. You might need this information in your next activity. Good luck everyone! Alright boys and girls, that's about it for today's lesson. I hope to see you in the next video for our next lesson. Till then, take care and bye-bye!